Employee was right there. That number is employee. I'm so glad I was spared like the very last pair When you walk into the mall and you think they ain't there So you say a little prayer You don't want to be so vain But if I get them in my hands, I'll give them the best Hey, what's poppin' everybody? Welcome back to the channel It is your boy Truth And today, we're gonna be going to pick up these shoes right here, man And I hope Well, I don't know if I hope Let's see if y'all keep the same energy, man. I know a lot of people have been like, oh, I don't want, I don't want the sneaker. The, the material looks weird. The structure, all this other stuff. I've been hearing a lot of people knock this thing, but they did sell out on all the platforms as far as I can see all the sites. So it's going to be, it's going to be interesting to see what exactly happened with these shoes, especially considering the Red Thunder and the original Thunder shoes are sitting right around 300 to 400 mark, right, right, in, right in between there. So, but before we go for this content, man, make sure you guys go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your boy. I would greatly appreciate it. Today was 8-24-24, which is Mamba Day, as you guys can see back here. Kobe is my dude. Um, I wasn't able to hit on anything, not one thing, but it is what it is. I kind of didn't have great expectations to hit on anything to be honest with you so the fact that i didn't hit you know it is what it is but um i do want to go into the malls and see exactly what's going on see make sure everything is uh see what's sitting and see if these thunder fours are gonna be still sitting there i did hit on finish line salute to finish line for a size 11.5 which is my personal size but i ain't keeping them my neighbor wants them, so he's gonna be blessed with those. And um, also, I'm gonna be trying to see if, if I can finagle a size seven Y some way, somehow, as we're out and about. But yeah, man, so today I do wanna show you guys something. Since it is 824.24, uh, this is a Kobe T that um, I got yesterday from my guy, Ambitious Clothing. You'll see his link down in my description section. On the front end of it, it says, Be Legendary, as you guys can see right here. And then on the back, you just have MJ and Kobe. And you got a whole bunch of different sayings and stuff like that on it. Super dope. And I've been looking for a reason to rock these for a minute now. So I feel like this is going to be perfect. So this is going to be the fit that I will be rocking today. I'll put some pictures up and show you guys what it actually looks like. But um, but I'm going to go ahead and get ready, get up in the car, and we're going to go to finish line. And we're going to see what's going on with these right in the forest. Comment down below and let me know if you cop. There you go. All right, y'all. So we are at the mall. We're going to try to go in and grab these sneakers. Like you can see, I got my man Ace baby girl right here um size 11.5 is what i what is what i was able to pick up shout out the finish line if you are not on the finish line app and you're not buying stuff off finish line to get the exclusive access man you messing up make sure you are on finish line doing that because you not only are you able to secure a pair but you're also able to get the actual sneaker for a discounted price with your reward points because you can use them on the releases but as i'm as i'm sitting here i'm also seeing a lot of people come out and they are like having three or four bags and it's been a while since i've seen people like have a bunch of pairs so that means that people do think that the resale value of these sneakers are going to be well worth it so go pick up your pairs man let's go get this sneaker all right so shout out to jd sports we do have them secured as you guys can see right here this one was a size 11.5 y'all see the size tag and stuff like that I just want to show y'all real quick. Um, this is the box that it comes in, as you guys can see. Um, nothing special about the box, just what, what we can see. Um, open up this box, big stack of paper. And then we do have the Air Jordan 4 White Thunder. I mean, not a bad sneaker at all. Quality looks like it's pretty solid for the most part. Um, just like your Red Thunders and your regular OG Thunders, your Yellow Thunder 4s. Just swapped out the other color block into white um you see the white cajun on the side a lot of people have been saying that these look off and uh i don't know y'all let me know do they look off to you guys but you got the black jump man logo on the back no quality control issues from what i can see on this pair a little bit of ashiness on the toe box but i just think that's because of the material mm. type of material is black sock liner booty of them right there Y'all see what the bottom of these things look like. But all in all, a pretty solid sneaker, in my opinion. Pretty solid sneaker. I do think these shoes are going to go up in value. Um, don't sleep on them thinking that they're not. They will increase in price. Guaranteed, man. Just a four and just a color blocking. 
And no matter, I, I want to know if y'all kept the same energy. Let me know. I have been seeing quite a bit of people walk around with multiple bags. So that means that they're thinking about reselling. And people think that this shoe will go up in price. And I definitely agree with that, man. But y'all let me know down in the comment section. Y'all pick them up. Uh, yeah, man. The Air Jordan 4 White Thunder. Lego. All right, y'all. So that is it for today's video. I just wanted to show y'all pick me picking these things up. I do it on feet for y'all and all that good stuff. But let me know as you guys are picking these things up. Are they selling out in your area or are they sitting around? And do you see multiple people buying these things? So what is your prediction? Do you think these things are going to go up in price? Because I do. I think that that's, they're going to be a shoe that you definitely do not want to sleep on resale wise. And it is a wearable sneaker. This is the type of sneaker you could just you know put by the front door and you can rock it with anything it's like no thought process as far as like matching this sneaker so and it's a jordan 4 so you can't go wrong i can't think of one jordan that has dropped that has been black and white that didn't sell out and didn't do well in numbers but i appreciate you guys tapping as always y'all in the sense man rock what you like that was hype and remember everything we talk about just bait we're from the share my faith i'm gonna catch y'all next video peace get they ready we'll let you know what you should go and get a we got back we got two we